Thank you for your testimony. Obviously, the restaurant and the hospitality industry is enormously important in Louisiana, as in other places. Um, do you believe these proposed changes to the overtime threshold would make it harder to attract and train new managers in your restaurants? Yes, I do. Um, a uh, company like myself and most of uh, the restaurant industry, it's, a, it's at entry level managers, it's an opportunity that we seek when we're hourly employees. Um, and by increasing that salary level so high, it forces our restaurants to put a lot more people in hourly, hourly positions. So we lose the opportunity for people that want to grow to, um, to move into salary. That's what we look for. I mean, when, when, I'm, when I was waiting tables, I wanted to be a manager. It, was, it, it will be demoralizing for my entry-level positions to move them back to, in, to hourly positions. That's what we want. And we, want, and we are in an, our industry because we have a passion for it, not because we're doing it for the sake of doing it. The, if you, you see the growth, in, especially in, in New Orleans, from pre-Katrina and normal restaurants and the opportunities, we had 800 restaurants in New Orleans, to 1,400 now, and it's people like myself that were young, eager, and wanted to take the opportunity. The restaurant industry is very similar. It is it's just like the United States. It is an industry opportunity. And we want to take the chance to become entry level, and a restaurant can't afford to pay $50,000 and $45. And, and to take you yourself as an example, you went from very entry level hourly position to manager, to owner of a, of a group. Do you think this sort of proposal, had it been in place at the time, would effect effectively have been a, a much bigger barrier to that sort of yeah. progression? Being in a salary employee, it, it gave me the flexibility to attend school, to attend college, to further my education. Imagine I couldn't go to work eight hours a day, for, you know, all the time. I, I, I woke up in the morning at 6 a.m., took classes at 8 a.m., went to work at a restaurant, managed a chef, went back to school, study, took more classes, or work Friday, Saturday, and Sunday so that I can further my education, which allowed me to take the risk and be an entrepreneur, which is, was my dream. And we started with one restaurant, and everybody in our industry, in my company, has developed from within. We have given the same opportunities that, that I took when I was a young boy to be part of a restaurant. And every restaurant we own, we have people that were entry level that are now part owners in our business. Perfect example is Alain Shia. Yeah. Thank you very much. And again, congratulations on that recognition for sure.